Going to the expo, taking the boys, seeing what's new. Dina, start your engines because we get to show you a preview of the Utah Auto Expo before the doors open to the public at 11 o'clock. This runs through Monday. It is four days of automotive heaven. We are inside so you don't deal with the slush and the cold outside and you get to see things no one has seen before, including this little baby right here. This is a 2025 Subaru Forester and Jeff is in that driver's seat. How does it feel to be in a 2025 already, Jeff? It feels good. It's really nice getting cars here before they're actually out to the public. So this car won't start production for a few more months. We'll hopefully see it on the lots this summer to be ready for sale. All right, let's talk about some of the features. Hop out of there and tell us why, and by the way, doors aren't open to the public yet, but everybody here is stopping and checking this out because Absolutely. how cool. Yeah, so this car, brand new, a whole new design on this car, new bold styling, so different styling look than the regular Forester model. Got all the technology features, you got the 11-inch screen, Apple CarPlay, Android Auto, it's got the uh, auto lift gate in the back with your foot, everything like that, so it's all the good technology, but still a great Subaru that gets you through the snow like it is today. There's a little bit of snow out there today, Jeff. Snow. We call it Subaru weather. Subaru, this is Subaru, Subaru weather. This will get you right through the snow. Um, is this why people love auto shows? Because you can see things like this where you see them nowhere else yet. It's the best thing. Not only do you get to see the newer models, everything that's coming out, the newest, greatest things, but you get to see everything. You can compare cars against each other, look at the different models within each brand and against each brand, all in one place, all in weather controlled environments. I know Mitsubishi just walked by and said, come on over here. I said, no, I'm hanging out with Jeff right now. We're talking Subarus. And speaking of Subarus, what else are you showing off here at the auto show? So our other two big things we're showing here is we have our two wilderness editions. So these are the Subaru came out this a couple of years ago, which was making more rugged versions of each of their models. So we got the Outback here and the Crosstrek here. So the idea is to take a standard Outback, lift it up, put all terrain tires on it, make a more rugged version for you exploring the Utah wilderness. Jeff, they're tough. Yeah. They look they're so tough, tough don't they? It's tough and it's really cool what they do with all the accent features. So you see all the gold plating on the outside it also goes to the inside. So if you get to the inside of the oh, car, it all matches. Thomas, you might have to sides. bring the camera inside to show just right. those little features. Down to like the steering wheel and the stitching on the seats. It all matches all around to kind of create a cool look, really stylish vehicle. Is this your favorite? I love the wilderness editions, yeah. They just came out, the Outback one's been out for a couple of years and they just launched this a few few months ago actually. The so cross track cross track wilderness. So same idea is to build one that adds another half foot of ground clearance, gets you through those rocks out in the wilderness. Jeff, what is it about Subaru? Once you're part of the family, you don't get any other car. We have one of the best loyalty rates in the business. Once people buy Subarus, they don't go anywhere else. And what is it about Subaru and here at the auto show, dogs, a puppy set up right in the center of all the vehicles. You can't have Subaru without pets. So Subaru Loves Pets is one of our big initiatives that we have here. So at all of our auto shows, we do pet adoption events. So we have Second Chance coming here to do pet adoption. So we can actually come here, look at cars, and you can go home with a furry pet. Jeff, I think that's so cool. And I love cars, but I may love this little face even more. Rhonda is here from Second Chance Homeless Pets. Who are you holding, Rhonda? This is Leo. He's a three-month-old Australian Shepherd mix puppy, and he is available for adoption through our organization, Second Chance for Homeless Pets. You can see all our animals online at utahpetadoptions.org. Rhonda, I'm trying to hold the mic to your mouth, but Leo wants to talk today. Everybody, I need to be adopted. That face, I'm dying. How cute. They're getting lots of attention this morning. Yeah, we also have Trip here. He's a three-year-old cattle dog. He's a tripod. He's got three legs. Hi, Trip. Okay, there he is laying down over there, getting his little ear scratched and belly scratches. Trip is so sweet. So we have a three month old puppy here. We have a three year old dog. Rhonda, are you rotating pets throughout the show? Yeah, we're going to have new animals here every four hours. So nobody's going to be here for too long. Hopefully they find their adoptive home in the time that they're here. And if they don't, they're up for adoption at our adoption center. If someone doesn't walk away with both of these animals, I will be absolutely surprised. But there are so many pets out there that need a home. It's important. And I love that you're doing this in combination with the car show. Yeah, Subaru loves pets. And it's really, really great that they are having us here. So we are very excited to be here. Um, they've stolen the show. I mean, I'm sorry, Jeff, no one's looking at the cars anymore. What do we do? It's all about the animals, right? It's all about the animals. You come here, 
look at cars and look at that and, and get yourself a new and dog. Get yourself a new dog to put in the back of that brand new Subaru. That face, I, Thomas. I'm sorry. Go again. <laughs> close up. Close up on little Leo. <gasps> oh, everybody! I'm at the Utah Auto Expo. Doors do not even open until 11 o'clock, so we get a preview before anybody else. You got to go inside. It runs until Monday. So come bring your family. Opens at 10 a.m. over the next three days, but 11 a.m. today. Come check out the 2025 Subaru Forester, all the new cool things here at the Auto Expo, and go to our website for all the information about hours and tickets. Rhonda, thank you so much for all you do. Make sure you come and look at the pets to adopt. Dina, are you dead? Do you need this dog? Um, I wish you could see my face right now. A hush fell over the studio. I think half of the crew is on their way. We're all fighting over Leo. <gasps> oh, what a great so time Dina, you're having. I, Dina, he is puppy breath. You know that puppy breath that you just grit your teeth because you can't stand it? I <gasps> sure do. Look at those. Uh, hi, Angel. Okay, so back to the cars. Anyway, sorry, pull out. Back to the cars. The auto expo is going to be amazing. Okay, here's your assignment. <laughs> Come back with the Subaru Forester for me and put Leo in it. Check and check. Done. Got you. All right, thank you, Niche, for that sponsored interview.